All right, so here's the next step in our science project bass guitar, cigar box, build your own pickup. Got everything pretty much cut out and ready to assemble. There's just a few little steps left, but I thought this would be a good point to jump in and make another video. Um, what we basically did here was this pickup, we took uh, some copper wire, wound it around two bolts. Underneath we have the magnets to create the field that the string vibrates through, interrupts, transmits sound, and I know that's the least scientific way to explain that. We used a uh, old extension cord to solder everything in because it also is made out of copper wire. And so we got our volume knob and our input jack, which might seem pretty simplistic, but just for the record, uh, Malcolm Young of ACDC, that's all he had set up in his rhythm guitar that he played pretty much on every song. He only would switch out guitars for a retune and go right back to that one. So if it works for that, it's probably great for a cigar box. On the neck here, we've got our holes drilled out where we can slide in these repurposed tuning keys because I have a lot of scrap guitar pieces and parts. Um, on this yardstick that I use for a fretboard. You can see my pencil lines I made to cut and lay in the frets. We'll probably just use finishing nails again for that and uh, probably do that tomorrow night. Because um, last time I did uh, the other one based off the scale length of a mandolin I believe. This is a bass guitar based on the scale length of a six string acoustic guitar. So it'll be a little shorter easier to work with hopefully and so right here you see where we thickened the neck up a little bit for the body through design uh, we're gonna have to cut out a little bit here to make room for the pickup to sit in its place right here in the body but everything's cut out it fits right so now it's really just a matter of making some cuts and tweaking some things and slapping it together so there you go